I'm Chef Andrew and this is Feed the Beast. Today, we're gonna tackle the holidays using one oven with CTX to run a whole meal. At my house, it's all about the steak for that special meal. So we have a bone-in sous vide ribeye here ready to go. We're making bread pudding. We have assorted mushrooms with some cracked pepper and chilies. Asparagus with a nice bright citrusy hollandaise sauce and some roast fingerling potatoes that we're gonna to toss with a nice vinegar mustard for a warm salad. Since we're gonna do a bread pudding, need a little bit longer cook time, we're gonna start with dessert first. Dessert is working, now it's time for the main course. Best part about the CTX and the automated process is it allows me to put all these items in one pass. The success of the CTX really comes from its flexibility. You have four zones of independently controlled high intensity heat that works like the power of the sun. That combined with the ability to split the belts, to be able to self-clean, preset, and keep an eye, eye on things with IoT trackability and open kitchen, it really allows the owner operator to have a safe investment and know what's going on with his equipment every day. Check it out, everything's out. Look at the steak, it's perfect every time. Beauty of the consistency of the CTX. What we're gonna do, we're gonna slice a little bit of this up, plate it back in our cast iron. Gotta add the bone. Awesome, we got it now, we gotta dress it up. So a little bit of blue cheese, some pickled red onions. Splash a nice Maldon salt to finish here. We got our mushrooms to accompany on the side. And the secret weapon to steak in our house, kimchi. Why kimchi? Kimchi, that tangy, extra little crunchy bite, completely offsets and brings a nice bright finish to the savory meal. Obviously, this was all done in a commercial kitchen. Other than the CTX, no special equipment was really used. So hopefully this gives you guys some inspiration and allows you to be the rock star at your upcoming holiday dinner. Join us next time for Feed the Beast.